Hello everyone and welcome to day one of your five-day yoga sculpt program. Today is going to be more of a cardio vinyasa flow. So we'll be moving through a lot of chaturanga dandasanas, moving through upward dog to downward dog, really engaging the whole body and raising that heartbeat and building that internal and external heat. So the only thing you'll need for this class is some yoga blocks for modification, some water, a yoga mat, but we will begin at the top of our mats to start. We're going to go through Surya Namaskar A and B, Sun Salutation A and B. So starting with the, with the feet together, we're going to bring the hands up and overhead, hands come together. Swan diving, exhaling, hands come down to the mat or onto your blocks, bending the knees slightly, allowing the nose to come down to the knee. We're going to inhale, halfway lift. Option to stay on the mat or come up onto the shins. Exhale, hands come back down. Stepping back into plank, we'll hold here. We can move to that Chaturanga Dandasana, coming all the way down. Inhaling, upward dog. Exhaling, downward dog. We'll hold here for three breaths before running through that two more times. So inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. One. Two. Three. We're gonna straighten the legs, look forward, walking the feet to meet the hands. Exhaling, dropping our head down to the knee. Inhaling, standing all the way up. Bringing hands back down to the chest. We're gonna run through that two more times. So again, inhale, arms come up. Exhale, swan dive. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale down. Step back into your plank. Hold here. Move through that Chaturanga Dandasana. Upward dog. Exhaling, downward dog. Again, three breaths here. You can certainly bend the knees, allow the hamstrings to stretch a little bit more. Give me one more breath. Again, inhaling, looking forward, walking the feet to meet the hands. And we'll exhale, nose to me. Inhale all the way up. Exhale, bring those hands down to the chest. One last time. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale, swan dive. Nose to knee. Halfway lift. Exhale, hands back down to the mat. Step back to plank. And then move through your flow. Upward dog. Exhaling, downward dog. Again, three breaths, and then we'll move into Sun Salutation B. Look forward, walk the feet to meet the hands. Exhale, nose to me. Inhale, all the way to standing. Hands come to chest. Surya Namaskar B starts in a chair pose. So we're going to squat, bringing our arms down, trying to touch the mat, coming up. The gaze goes diagonal, slightly up towards the ceiling. And then we're gonna exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale down. Step back into plank. And we'll move through that flow again. Upward dog. Exhaling. Downward dog. We're going to step our right foot forward, pivoting the left foot. Inhaling, arms come up. Knees goes to ceiling. Exhale, sink a little bit deeper. And then we'll bring our hands back down, stepping back into plank, moving through that vinyasa. Inhale, upward. Exhale, downward. Then we're going to bring the left foot forward, pivoting the right. Again, arms come up. Exhaling. Get a little bit deeper. 
bring those arms back down, and we'll move through that flow. Upward dog. Exhaling. Downward dog. Three breaths here. We'll run through this one more time before coming to the mat. Look forward, walk your feet to meet your hands. Exhale, nose to knee. Inhale, we're gonna bring the arms up, back to chair pose. And then exhale to come up to standing. One more of those. Inhale, arms come down to the mat, hands come up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift on the mat or on the shins. Coming back down to the mat, stepping into plank. Moving through that vinyasa. Exhale downward. Again, bring that right foot forward. Pivot the left. Inhale. Arms come up. Exhale. Getting deeper. Coming back down to the mat. Going through that flow. Exhale. Meeting me back and downward. Again, bring the left foot forward. Pivoting the right. Inhale. Arms come up. Exhale, sink deeper. Come on down to the mat. Going through that vinyasa one last time. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward. Last three breaths before rolling, rolling down to the mat and coming into a child's pose. Come up onto your tippy toes, roll forward, bring your knees down to the mat, maybe towards the outside of the mat if you're looking to get a good stretch in the hips. Bringing your chest onto the mat, allowing the hips to open up a little bit deeper. Coming onto our forearms, we're going to extend the left leg, making sure the hip is turned down and not externally rotated out towards the right side. We're going to then just lift the right foot and lower it for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Holding it up, we're just going to bend the knee and straighten it, curling the knee in and out. 8, 7, 6, Five, keeping the core engaged. Four, three, two, and one. Keep it curled up, and then we're just gonna pulse up for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring that knee down, exhale, back to child's pose. Rolling back through that child's pose, coming back to your forearms, now tucking the right toes, extending the left leg long. Then we're going to lift the left leg and lower it again for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and one, holding it up, we're gonna curl it in for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Keeping that curled up, just pulsing up for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, bring that left knee down, again exhaling into a child's pose.
slowly roll yourselves on up. We're gonna come to a seated position. So we're gonna extend our legs long, working a little bit more on the top of the leg, the quad. So we're gonna bring the hands behind the head, lifting the leg, the right leg, and then we're gonna exhale, bringing it in to the left elbow. Extend, and then in. Give me eight more. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Keeping that leg out, we're just gonna lower it and lift it. 10, nine, eight, seven, got it, six, five, sit up tall, four, three, two, and one. Inhale up, exhale, fall forward. Dropping the head, really trying to get a good stretch along the hamstrings, as well as the back of the neck. Inhale, bring those arms up behind the head. We'll do the same on the left, flexing that left, bringing it in, and touching the right elbow for one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Leaving it out, lift and lower. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Inhale, exhale, forward fold. Staying here for about 30 seconds giving yourself a chance to breathe and ease into those muscles here. Give me three more breaths in this position. Inhale, all the way up. We're gonna roll onto our forearms, maybe moving up a little bit, coming down, and then lifting up. From here, we're just going to bring the leg up, out, and around. Give me 10, nine, eight, seven. Embrace the shape. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Leaving that leg, bringing that leg back up and bringing it out to the side. We're just gonna lift and lower. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bring it all the way up, lower it down. You know we have to do the other side. Readjust to sit up if necessary. Bring that left leg up and around for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, and one. You guys know the drill. Bring that leg up and out, and then bring it up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Bring that knee down or that leg down. Roll yourselves on up. We're going to cross our knees, coming back to a downward dog, exhaling as you do so. So you work the core, the arms, the legs, pretty much the full body, I think it's safe to say. So we're gonna run through a just quick 
power blast to finish off this practice. So we're going to run through Sun A and Sun B as we did in the beginning, but a lot faster before coming down to finish. So again, inhale, come up on your tippy toes, look forward, and then we're going to walk our feet to our hands. Again, exhale, forward fold, inhale, arms come up, exhale, samasthi to heat. Let's run through that two times for A, two times for B, and then we'll be done. So again, inhale, arms come up, exhale, swan dive. Inhale, halfway lift, exhale down. Step back into a plank, lean forward, move through that chaturanga, dandasana. Upward dog, exhaling, downward dog. Again, hopping or stepping. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, all the way up. One more time. Exhale, swan dive. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale down, back to plank. Move through that vinyasa, meeting me in upward dog. Exhaling, back to downward. Again, you have that option to jump or step. And then we'll exhale, forward fold. This time going into chair pose, we're gonna come right into it. Exhaling, forward fold. Inhaling, halfway. Exhale down, move through that vinyasa. Meeting man up. Exhaling, back to downward. Bringing that right foot forward, pivoting the left. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale, spawn dive. Moving through that vinyasa. Upward dog. Exhale, downward dog. Bring that left foot forward, pivot the right. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale down. Come back. Move that through that vinyasa. Meeting me and downward dog. Again, you can step or hop to the front. And then we'll exhale, nose to knee. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, standing. Let's do that again. Arms come down to the mat and up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, down. Move that vinyasa. We are almost done. Inhale, upward. Exhale, downward. Bring that right foot forward, pivot the left. Up, exhale, down. Go for that vinyasa. Upward dog, exhaling. Back to downward. Again, left comes forward, right goes back. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, come down. Moving through that vinyasa. Exhaling. Downward dog. Last five breaths here of this practice before we we'll come to child's pose to finish. Gazing at the toes. The shins. The knees. The top of the thighs. And maybe even the navel. From here, we're gonna move ourselves forward, dropping the knees, maybe the, bringing them to the outside of your mat, exhaling back to child's pose. Forehead comes down to the mat. We'll spend the last minute in this pose. Really taking a minute to catch your breath, maybe using some ujjayi breath, breathing in through the nose, out through the back of the throat. It's also known as oceanic breathing or victorious breath. Inhaling through the nose, constricting the back of the throat, exhaling. Again, into the nose. About 20 more seconds here.
When you're ready, slowly roll yourselves up, bringing the knees in, coming to seated. That was day one of your five day yoga sculpt program. Again, today was more of a cardio induced vinyasa flow. So I know I'm feeling a little warm. I don't know about you guys, but I definitely suggest to staying hydrated. Go drink some water, get some nourishment in your body, and I will see you in day two. I'll see you guys soon. Namaste.